Hello everyone, I'm Phoenix from Maine and I want to do this daily recap for you for Journal Hospital for Thursday, September the 10th. Now please take a minute to subscribe. Please check out the membership if you want to become a member. Um, also hit that like button so other soap fans can know that this is a good video for soaps. And um, let me know in the comment section if you want me to continue recaps. I'm going to recap this week and I'm going to recap next week and then I'll decide if this is a good thing to continue doing the channel. I'm going to try to keep my recaps between 3 and 5 minutes. Down the Restless, it goes to 6. I can't help it. I, I just have a lot to, to, to argue about. But um, on September 10th today, um, <laughs> now does anybody else, is anybody else bothered by this? Lisa, um, who plays Olivia, is 50. Tristan is, who plays Robert is 74 and Emma Sams is 60 you know who plays um, you know what I'm talking about Holly so Emma Tristan a lot closer in age to me it's kind of more of a believable co uh, combination it seems like they're moving uh, Robert and Olivia sort of like they're gonna be like paired up together and I love that Olivia actually has something to do because I've loved her from when she was on Loving in the City. I know she's a really good actress. And General Hospital has, except for her initial storyline with Sonny, finding out they had a son together, Dante, um, we've never really seen her, even when they made her psychic. That just told you they had no idea what to do with the character. That now I'm glad that she at least is getting a storyline in a direction and she's knocking out the park because as soon as they gave her something real to do, She's actually doing doing a great job at it. But I'm like, do I really want Robert to be a love interest? I barely want Ned to be a love interest. I feel like she deserves a really hot guy in her age range. Whereas Robert Scorpio, they need to just bring Holly back full time and bring back that Holly Robert chemistry dynamics. Even Robert and Laura. But I think I don't know. It just reminds me when Clint Eastwood does a movie. And he'd be like 65, and his wife be like 30. <laughs> I'm just sad. That's just my little thing. Hopefully it's not considered ageism. I'm just saying. So, Great Robert and Holly flashback is one of my notes. Stella returns from Mike's slow decline. His oh-so-slow decline. Now, my mother was a really slow decline, too. So, I know this is a, a realistic, you know... It was almost surreal when she finally went because there were so many times we thought, okay, this is it, this is the end, and then she continued to live, and then it just like it took years. So I know that that this is realistic for them to stretch it out the way they're stretching it out, but I'm tired. I'm tired. I'm glad that they're saying it's, it's nearing the end. He's got pneumonia. He can barely breathe on his own. He's on oxygen. Max Gale, get your Emmy. You did a great job. I don't want you to lose your job. Come back as a ghost. You know, visit Sonny in his dream. Something. Flashback something. Be like the new uh, um, Alan. I was trying to think of Monica's husband named Alan. Be the new Alan. Come visit. But uh, let Mike go. <laughs> Please let Mike go. Um... So we had Stella return for that slow decline, because she's the help. Nina, um, not one to talk to the guy about the necklace, got on my nerves, because I'm so tired of him stretching out, her finding out that Nell's her daughter. Um, I'm tired. Please don't stretch this out to November sweeps, but I think that's the direction they're going in. Um, Dev is back. Joss is all over Cam, and he's excited. Dev kind of just watches. Now, this is why... I've been against the Cam and Trina relationship the whole time. Since as long as I can remember, Cam has desperately wanted Jocelyn. Jocelyn didn't want Cam. And then eventually, Jocelyn wanted um, Oliver, whatever his name is, Oscar. She wanted Oscar. And so Cam constantly, desperately went after her. And then Trina, the black girl, got rejected by Cam, got rejected by Dev. And it's like they're throwing her bone. Like, okay, so now you and Cam can can be together. I'm like, Trina is smart, fun, sassy, 
great family dynamics. She lights up the screen when she's on. She hasn't done that since they've been back because they haven't really given her no scenes. But, you know, when she is on screen, there's something special about her. She's going to be a star long after she's left General Hospital. And seeing her not have her own love interest, I wanted someone to chase after her because she's worth it. And I knew that if they put Cam uh, and Trina together, the moment they had Joss won him, he was going to be like, oh, Joss, I got a shot with Joss, so why do I want the runner-up uh, uh, um, settle for Trina? I don't like that for the character that Cam is settling for Trina because Joss wasn't interested. Now that he knows Joss is interested, Trina who? And in a... In a next episode is like Dev is like hey you gotta pick one I'm like I'm done I, she deserves better than than that that she needs guys chasing after her not her chasing after guys um <clears throat> I hate Nicholas hair I'll say that again I hate Nicholas hair Ava calls Liz for not wanting him to be famous because she failed as a painter now that's Ava delivering some, some some good shade. And then they showed Ava and Franco end up kissing. And it, somebody took a picture of it. But then Liz and Nicholas started kissing. And then somebody took a picture of that. So I guess Ava and Nicholas going to come together like, Ha ha, I gotcha. And they're both going to be like, oh, stalemate. <laughs> we both got pictures of each other kissing someone else. So, <clears throat> yeah, that happened. Uh, Robert gets a call from Holly, but it sounds like they're using snippets. I do believe Holly is alive. I don't think that that call was from Holly. It sounded like they took clips of Holly's voice, maybe off an ass machine, something, I don't know. But it's, I think that's what it's going to turn out to be. I know Peter wanted Robert to get off his back, and he wanted to use a Holly situation to distract him. I think that is just Peter continuing with his plan. So thank you for watching. I went seven minutes. I didn't mean to go seven minutes. But thank you for watching. Let me know what you thought about this recap. And I'll catch you in the next video.